If you're wondering what time is it, well, it's time to write this journal. <laughs> to write this journal. So if you're wondering what is write this journal about, well, as mentioned in the cover, it means to destroy your journal. And you're asking, why should you do such things? Well, it's, it's already summed up in the first page. To create is to destroy. So, well, I'm aiming at becoming a more creative person. I'm going to destroy this journal. So, pretty easy. Like, my last video, I'm going to follow the instructions written in this book and I'm going to do around 10 entries for this video. So yes, let's start. So here's the first instructions for my first entry. Stand here, wipe your feet, jump up and down. Pretty easy. Let's rock this journal. This is the result of my first entry. So, I feel like it's not right enough. If it's torn apart, that would be better. But still, yep, that's the result of standing there and jumping up and down. Now, let's go to the second entry. Now, here is the second entry. Poke holes, okay? In this page, using a pencil so my tools are ready here's a pencil and i'm gonna poke it <laughs> Yes, that's pretty much. Poking hoes. <laughs> I feel suddenly a relief of stress. And maybe a bit of art. Yep, that's the result. Now, let's go on to our third entry. Now, my third entry. Draw fat lines and thin. Pushing really hard with the pencil. So with this, I use this different pencil. And let's see the result. Okay, here is the result of this entry. Really thick lines. I don't really see thin lines, but yeah. A lot of stress relief at this point as well. <laughs> now let's go to our fourth entry. Now our fourth entry. This is something that I really like. This page is for hand prints or fingerprints. Get them dirty then press down. <laughs> so I have already got some paint here and let's do some fingerprint art so here's the result what do you think of it? Do you think I can be the next Picasso? I'm not sure. Well, yeah. Let's do the fifth entry. Now, the fifth entry. Pretty easy. Color this entire page. Let's do it. This is the 
final result of coloring my page, the entire page, with so different colors. Yep, this is the fifth entry. Now, let's go to the sixth entry. Now, the sixth entry. So, throw something, a pencil, a ball, dipped in paint. So, let's do it! I got pretty good marks, you can see. 50 marks, a lot of paint here. Let's go to our next entry. Okay, for our next entry is this. Scratch, okay? Scratch using a sharp object. So what I can think of is scissors. Let's do some scratching. So here's the result. As you can see, I've already scratched a lot. And some of them, there's holes. And yeah, I feel pretty great. I'm satisfied with my work. Yep. Okay, let's go to our next entry. So, our next entry is do some rubbings with a pencil. So, once again, I need a pencil and I will find something where I can rub on. Okay, before I start, let me show you the things that I'm going to rub on. Here's a coin, a mirror, I guess you know this, can you guess what's this? Well, if you know, please leave a comment below. Uh, this cover. Yep, these are gonna things that I'm gonna rub on. Oops. Yay, let's start. Out. As you can see, this is the rubbings, and I feel like the mirror, this one, was the best for rubbings. And it is quite interesting when you use uh, coins because they move around in that they, you know, you can create special patterns, you know, moving around. And there's not a single pattern that was like fully drawn, but still, there's a bit of art coming from it. So, this is really interesting. Coins are a very nice choice for the rubbing. Yep, okay, now let's go to our next entry. Okay, now, this one. This one, I like it. Scribble wildly, violently, with reckless abandon. So, looking forward to it, let's do it. result you can see how wildly how fondly have I done to this page scribbling it was a lot of fun to be honest a lot of stress relieved Whew. but still I guess a bit of artist reviewed I'm not sure but yeah let's go to our last entry for today the tenth entry okay our last entry Tear strips, or stripes, strips, yes, yeah, strips. Rip it up. Mm. 
la it's time to rip something up. Okay, so this is the last entry and I really, literally, rip up this page. So, um, yeah, so I have did 10 entries now and in the future I will do more like do more videos if you like do more other entries and yeah so let's sum up the result for today so this is the first entry second entry best thing is at the back here the third entry The fourth entry. The fifth entry. The sixth entry. The seventh entry. Eighth entry, ninth entry, and the tenth entry. So, what do you think? Do you think I successfully wrecked this first ten entries? If you think so, please give me a thumbs up and comment below. And yeah, what I think about this book is really amazing. Other than, you know, being inspired, I can see a few arts being created when I destroy something. And what I think is, other than becoming like more creative and creating art, this whole book, the things I've just done, help me to relieve a lot of stress, to be honest. Like poking and stuff, yeah. It sounds horrible, but still, you're just wrecking this journal, and I feel much, much relaxed. I'm not. I don't know why, but and I'm so amazed to see, even though I'm like destroying this whole book, some art is being created unexpectedly, and I feel like art is not created through you know formulas, instructions. It's about creating it freely, and this book's. This book helps us to do that and I feel like it's worth it. So in the future, I will be doing more uh, en entries for this, write this journal as well. Uh, so remember to stay tuned and remember to, if you love this video and you think I'm crazy enough to write this journal, please give a big thumbs up and there's a subscribe button somewhere here, around there, everywhere. And yeah. I feel like for today, I'm a, I feel really alive. I don't know why, but strangely alive. So do remember everyone, as I always like to say, um, stop existing, start living, and be alive. Bye! By the way, if you think this is too crazy for you, well, check out my last video where I complete another creative journal, which is this, which is much more serious. So if you're not fond of craziness and wrecking your journals and you would like to see some like normal art creating process, well, check my last video out where I complete this journal.